Hello guys, Solitaire Gamer here, and today I'll be reviewing the anime series Link Click. This anime had such a high score on my anime list, and got so much praise from people that watched it. I was hesitant about watching the anime first, because it's an anime series based on Chinese source material. You could tell the source material was Chinese by how the anime style looked. It just didn't look appealing to me, not to mention the voices were not Japanese. I dropped this anime several times, and I kept trying to watch it over and over. I finally got myself to watch the entire anime series. After watching it, I could now understand why so many people liked it. The plot was so exciting to watch. In this anime, the characters Xiao Xi and Guan have the power to go back in time. They can go back to a particular moments within the photograph. Xiao Xi becomes the person who took the photograph in the first place, and Guan tells him where to go and what to say. They aren't trying to change the past. What they're doing is gathering information for their clients. But as Xiao Xi experiences the sad lives of several individuals, you can't help but want to change the past. Anytime time traveling is involved, it's going to catch the interest of many anime fans. Even though this concept has been done many times, there's just something so intriguing about it. The anime handles the time traveling aspect well. It was done in a very unique and creative way. Now the main character gets to experience the pain and sadness people go through in life, and that obviously set up many emotional moments. Now Xiao Xi is feeling very sad as well, and you can't help but wonder if he'll try to change the past. And can he actually change it? Guan states multiple times that he can't really change the past that much. You can change the small details, but the important event will always stay the same. There are just so many sad moments throughout the anime series, and can't help but hope Xiao Xi will be able to change the past for it better. The anime is just so tense, as many disturbing things occur throughout the anime series. You don't know what to expect next. I was concerned this anime series would be just episodic episodes, but all these episodes provide a great buildup to a crazy final arc, where something really unexpected happened. Now everything that happened earlier in the anime series makes sense. It's all connected and it's just so mind blowing to see. This anime series mainly focuses on two main characters, Xiao Xi and Guan. These two really fit each other well as a team. Their strengths help cover for the weaknesses. Xiao Xi is a very caring guy, and will do whatever it takes to help people. But he loses cool a lot of times, and that puts him at risk for getting in danger. Guan helps him calm down, and think about the objective. Without Xiao Xi, Guan would play things too safe and wouldn't be able to get some major clues on certain cases. They need each other in order to solve cases of missing people and to catch criminals. The opening song and ending song were catchy and nice to hear. The music for the anime series certainly helped portray how sad certain scenes were. I was not a big fan of the animation style, but you eventually get used to it. The animation looked good throughout the anime series, the anime may be hard to watch at first with Chinese voices and the odd animation style, but the plot and emotional moments throughout the anime series make the anime worth watching. I give this anime series a 8 out of 10. So that's all we'll talk about for this video. Thank you for watching the video. Have a great day or night wherever you are. And please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And please comment if you find anything interesting in the video.